Hey guys, so we are diving in today, the Medium's R357, and just my overall thoughts on this weapon. In the test grounds, this weapon does great, and even in gameplay, this weapon does it even better in my opinion. I like this gun. I'll dive into a little bit later why I don't think people want to use this gun, but if you can land your shots with this gun, I think you'll do really well. Now, this weapon does better on a more one-to-one -one versus like maybe a, a 1v2, but if you have a teammate working well with you, you guys can be wiping the floor and this gun can do it. Now, I can see why some people would prefer the AK or the SCAR, but I think this gun is kind of somewhat of a sleeper for the medium. Now, kind of, you know, diving into the medium's recoil for this gun, this gun actually has some of the best recoil, I think, for all the medium's guns. Now, that would just be because it's a revolver, but aiming down sights, this weapon has no recoil. Hit fire is pretty strong. Now, movement hit fire for this gun, not so great, but most guns don't really have a good movement hit fire. Now, the crouch hit fire on this is identical pretty much to aiming down sights. I've not really seen that. And I think this gun is somewhat of a sleeper in my opinion. Now, I think diving into why I don't think it will become super popular in some cases is because of the irons. I'm not a fan of these irons. They're, they can feel a little rough um, and you can feel like you're shooting at someone and you're just whiffing. I, at the end of the day, I would love to just see some red dots. I just want a red dot option for all my guns. I, I Maybe we'll see that in the next season. I, I doubt it. I, I think it's part of the balancing with all of this, but I would really love to see a red dot. Um, but, you know, in my gameplay, you can see that in some cases I'm kind of missing, but a lot of cases in which I'm also landing those shots long range, close range, and I think this gun is a, a lot of fun. And it's highly unutilized in my opinion, just because I think people gravitate toward more of the ARs, you get more rounds, a lot more forgiving. You got six rounds in this, less forgiving, but I mean, it, it dishes out the damage and you could argue that close range, you're gonna have a hard time, but you know, even if a little light rolls up on you, now if a light rolls up on you with the double door shotgun, you know, they can quickly two tap you. The same market can be said that if you land a headshot with this on a light and one quick melee, they're probably gonna die before they get their second round off with that shotgun. So just something to consider that this gun I, I really like this gun, so if you have the opportunity to try it out, let me know what your thoughts are. Do you guys like this gun? Do you think, eh, it's, it's good, it's just not that good? You know, let me know down in the comments, and I hope to catch you guys on the finals, and you guys have a good one. On behalf of our sponsors, thanks for tuning in. And that's a wrap.